What's up, ladies and gents? Welcome back. I'm your host, Sinistrino One. Oh, he go be oh, he's floating. The magical dog who floats while he sleeps. All this and more next on 60 Minutes. What's up, ladies and gents? There he is. He's awake now. Let's give him a good little pet. I like me a good floating dog. We are back with more Assassin's Creed Valhalla. So I'm trying to stay true to making sure that I get things finished up and done. So that's why uh, I haven't had a stream in a few days because I've been focusing on getting Call of Duty finished, which I would have had finished by now if it wasn't for the fact that for I'm floating too. It's like there's a step here. Ladies and gents, there is an invisible step that the developers have put into this little itty bitty place. I I don't even know what to say. I'm trying to talk and, and be serious, but wow, Assassin's Creed, you're making it a little hard for me to do here when I'm walking over your amazing How long does this step go? Oh my oh my god. That is like literally there isn't someone a developer had to put this there. It is literally like someone put a step up, a little walkway, and then a step down. Just in this little area. If you've got the game, especially on Xbox Series X, let me know if you've got this same thing. I know, is this, uh, is this the prequel to It? You all float down here. <laughs> You'll float! <laughs> I know. I kid, I know. Bugs are bound to happen. But sheesh, come on. Like, you're going to easily pass by this section so many times. This is your settlement. So, I wonder if this just happened. Look at that. And you can clearly see that there is, like, an invisible step right there. Huh. All right. Well, let's get back to what I was talking about. But as I said, I'm, I was trying to record uh, Call of Duty and finish that up so then I can start doing heavily on these videos. But um, the uh, and, and it's not just the Xbox. It's on uh, almost every console. It's on PC. It's on PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5, Xbox One. doesn't matter what you're playing Call of Duty, Black Ops, Cold War on. It's got major glitches, and I cannot play the game. I'm in a mission right now called End of the Line, and I literally cannot finish the mission. It will not let me. Uh, it'll just... It'll brick my Xbox within five minutes, and then that's it. So, I do apologize for not being able to get those videos out just yet. Hopefully, they'll do a patch. Just search it, um, you know, on Google, and you'll see that it's pretty much on every console. That it's just a bad optimization, or should I say a bad patch? That's the only thing I can think of right now. All right, so we've got... Some missions to do. Actually, since we're right here, why don't we go ahead and do that side mission that is literally right next to us? Good day, Eivor. The fish are biting. And the people are floating. <laughs> Sorry. Petra, what is wrong? It's my brother. Wallace was meant to return hours ago, but I've seen neither hide nor hair of him. He's usually punctual. I'd like to search the woods for him. But alone, I fear I would have little luck. Would you join me? Two could cover much more ground. Well, when we get to that part, we'll get to it, John. We should go now. Obviously, we're Do not you know there where yet, to start? Near Peterborough. It's where he buys his tanning liquids. I know he sometimes makes camp at a crossroads between here and there. Okay, so find Wallace's last known whereabouts. Wallace was following the inlands, inlands roads on the way back from Midashamatashnongundetedi Alley, Abbey. Uh, okay, I gotta, what the hell? Okay. Um, Wallace was following the inland roads on his way back from Midashamatashnongundetedi 
Okay, so where is Medeshete Machacho? I mean, wouldn't it be like right around here? It says inland, right? So that means it's going to be away from here. So it's going to have to be more towards here. But I don't see anything that says Medeshamshi. So where is Medeshamshamshtidi? So that's what we need to look for right now. We're looking for Medeshtam, Stam, Stam, Wham, Stam, Bam. Thank you, ma'am. Weedy. Let's see. Okay, there's there's Medeshtam, Stam, Wham, Bam. Thank you, ma'am. Abby. Um, so he was following the inland roads. Every time it does that, I always get so... So... Okay, if here, where are we? So if we're here, we just need to really literally go in this direction. I would say it's probably over in here. Yes, I put it on random. I think, I don't think it actually lets you change. So, um, maybe we're not in the story to that yet. No, I'm not 100% sure. All I can tell you is that I put it on at the very beginning of the game. I mean, you can clearly watch the video. That, um, I put it on let the Animus choose for me. And the Animus chose a female. Uh, it seems... That's that's all it lets you choose that one single time and then that's it. We can retrace the steps. It's luck he hasn't done anything foolish. Is he prone to that sort of thing? Never. That's why his absence worries me. I told you how we found him, didn't I? You did. Led by a white elk to a lost babe in the woods. A fated encounter. Fated, yes. As if gifted from one guardian to another, he was bestowed on us like a like a babe among the reeds. Meda, okay. I'm not trying to make fun of your your the names of your stuff. It's America. We've got really hard pronouncing names as well. well I'm just not used to saying those types of uh, names. Yeah, I'm actually really enjoying the Call of Duty Cold War. Um, I love the way it's set up. I wish more Call of Duties would do stuff like that because I do remember there was that mission in World War II, Call of Duty World War II, that had the um, not the same premise, but was uh, similar to that, where you had to infiltrate that area. So, uh, I really love missions that, that allow you to have multiple routes and do multiple things. Okay, so this is like the main inland road, right? I mean, I'm only assuming that... I'm going the right way. Okay, so we've we've gone halfway at least. Let's continue to follow up until Mayday Shang Probably at least until here. See, even Jen, Jen, you even get it wrong. <laughs> I kid. Ah, oh, yes. The infamous blank paper. The very infamous paper known throughout generations. The only paper that was ever written in history that was blank.
Okay, so I mean, we made it here. And I've seen nothing yet. Wallace was following the inland's roads on his way back. Dominus autum et supplementum alpha to liquidia domino. Signatra unis pia et pis unis. What the hell are they doing? Everyone is literally. This is some straight up cult stuff right here. Yeah, detective. We'll, we'll definitely take a look at that stuff whenever we uh, do some more up upgrading. So I'm not seeing anything as of yet, everybody. I mean, I've ran pretty much. He was heading back to our place. I mean, there's our next. Oh, are you kidding me? I'm an idiot. Look at what I'm doing. I'm doing all of this, and it, the game literally points it out for me and I'm sitting here trying to follow like a path thinking I'm gonna be smart and I gotta figure this out myself but no the game said strain Over you're there. done he may have stayed somewhere nearby we'll if figure it did, out for you traces. that's what the game said the game said strain no you're done you can't do it by yourself let's put a question mark here so you know where to go that's literally what the game go. just told me. my eyes belong to Wallace. Why would he take them from his satchel here? That leads below ground to who knows where. Let's keep our wits about us. Careful, Petra. Look at its eyes. Oh, jeez! something wrong with this one. Oh, I'm stuck there. Stuck? Well, well, that just makes it so much easier when he's stuck. Why is the game going into like I can't see mode? Strong scent down here, strange and heady. I don't recognize it. There's a familiar sourness. I can't place it. Another smell of death. It is almost pleasant. stayed here. Seems he made something to eat. Why would he leave his campsite? Where could he have been going? <gasps> Must be Wallace's clothes. The trousers are wet. Probably pissed himself. He was the boar. He's a were-boar. What have you found? I saw it, Avo. I saw him nearby. Wallace? The white elk. The white elk that brought me to Wallace years ago. It was there. I, I mean, she just goes running like she knows exactly where he is. Do you even need me? Petra, where are you? Yeah. 
Petra! Hello! Mimir, guide me. Mimir, guide me. Have I lost her too? Oh, there's the white elk. Ah, the elk. You will know where she has gone. She's totally drunk. I think I think she's drunk. We must sneak on the white elk here. Let's stealth it. Very quiet. White elk. Oh, freeze. Elk sees us. Hold on. Blend in. Into the environment. We are the... Must be stealth. Yeah. I am... I am sorry to trouble you, Lord. Eivor, nice to see you here. Are you the white elk Petra told me about? <laughs> of course I am. Look at me. It may be you can help me. Petra has disappeared. I need to find her before the sun slips away. No, no. Petra hasn't disappeared. She's close, very close, and waiting for you. Follow me. You are the guardian of this place. Deliver comforting life. Out here among the hills and dales of Mercia. Oh, I get on, you know. I eat, I sleep, I frolic. I want for nothing and enjoy every moment. It is a decent life. And what are you and Petra doing out here, lurking about in the woods? Hunting, maybe? In a way, yes. We're looking for her brother, Wallace. She's been waiting for him all day. Oh, my dear, yes. Where could Wallace be? Oh, where? Oh, where indeed? Ha! Is Petra near? The Lord took him away from me. She was here a moment ago. <laughs> Sorry. Well, what is happening? I cannot stay. Not here, not now. Here in Midgarden. Return to Jotunheim! Go now or die here! What the heck is going on? Hey, I'm gonna need you guys just to like... What have you done with Petra? Except what's, uh... What the rocks are coming. What have you done to Petra? Answer me! Oh, what the heck? What am I will make I them need you guys Petra. to go ahead and just take some of this right truth. here. I must it. know where you are. Evil, I am yeah. right here. There is no need to question this carrion further. Oh, yes. Sorry. Uh, now come. I believe I know where we'll find Wallace. Up there. The His heck? trail leads this way. Petra, I met your old friend the White Elk. But he vanished before my eyes before I found you. You were visited! For a time. We talked until he vanished into the empty air. A shame, really. I enjoyed his presence. Ah! Oh, look there! This is strange, say, dear Petra. Where are you? <laughs> Over here! I love how this is a side mission, and it seems like it's really fun. Hey, Thor, come on! I'm up here. Petra? How are you doing this? There's no trick to it. I think about it, and it works. Easy as walking. Try it. Again? Petra, how? It's easy. The developers programmed me to join all of a sudden over here. It's so simple. How can I do that, Petra? Yes, just try it. Move! Run yeah. in a straight line! This is why you don't do drugs, kids. Alright. Move in a straight line? No! No, no! Too far! Too far! Amazing! You did it! Just like your Soonan! And not a scratch on you! Now let's go! Wallace should be over there. Are you sure Wallace is here? I see no one. I believe so. We should ask the rabbits. They will know something. Of course. The rabbits. 
she is still drunk or high or or both. Hey, what did the fox say? We've been here before. This is where the wolves attacked us. Right. Let us hope their spirits are not restless and that they do not wake to maul us. Oh no. The wolf spirits have wakened. Good day, Squirrel. I hope I'm not intruding, but have you seen my brother Wallace? Damn! This one doesn't speak rabbit! Oh, okay. Petra! Oh my god, man. Hurry! Tell me, little rabbit, have you seen a man named Wallace around here? Hmm, I see, I see. Thank you for your help. Avon, look! The elk has returned! What the hell? Dude, I'm, oh my god! Do you see it? The white elk <gasps> leading us to Wallace just as before. I see him. I do. Come on, Eivor, chase the elk! What the heck is going on here, man? I can't tell if these are glitches. Maybe they had a glitch in the game and they just didn't know how to fix it, so they made a quest around it. <laughs> with nothing to show for it. Uh, so what are we looking at? Wallace? You stone-brained stoat! We've been looking for you! And here I am, freshly rested and ready to work. You're days late! I was carrying quite a burden coming home. Slowed me down some, so I made a camp and picked some mushrooms for a nice soup. Turns out I picked some funny mushrooms, sent me into a tizzy, tore off my clothes, woke up naked and bruised in the woods. So I snuck home, naked as the day God made me, and grabbed some clothes. Now I'm off to get my tools. <laughs> mushrooms. So the elk. Just another dream. Maybe so. But don't scoff at dreams. They're often worth more than our waking hours. I may still be bussing from these mushrooms, but this is nice. I had fun today. Maybe we could do it again, without the mushrooms. We could, but I'll have to ask the rabbits for permission. Wow, I mean, that's such a weird quest, but jeesh. All right, saw a bunch of these here. Let's grab these. I did not expect to get that. I did not expect that quest. To be like that. I thought we were literally going to find out what was happening to him. And we were going to unlock some mystery. But. I really wasn't a mystery. as more of a. Hey let's get high for a second. Thanks for buying the game. <laughs> Alright. Uh, we got some skills. Um, Alright so we're power 68. We went a lot of up. You can see we're kind of. There's still more down here that we have left to uh, unlock and uncover. I don't think... Done that one. There is another one that leads there. So if we got these one, two, and three, it should lead us to another one. So that's a big health. But we can't get it. Why? Oh, because we got to get this one first. That led us to this one, and then there's more down there. This one is a sprint bat. Looks like he just pushes them aside. I really want... Alright, I really want to get new a new outfit. I'm, I'm kind of... It's not that I'm tired of this one. 
But I just wish that you could go to the store and that you can get a different outfit instead of it being the way that it is. I, I, I don't like the way that the upgrade system is at all in this game. I really don't. Um, all right, let's see what we got next to us. So this one is the, the new area we have, which is the King's Maker. Now, if I'm not mistaken, this is um, the mission set that we had did in our preview event, which wasn't actually that difficult. We also have all of these as well, side missions uh, to do in dreams, but we can't do in dreams until we get to level 90. As you see, in dreams leads us to the Asgard area. Uh, but we're almost there, but we're just not quite there yet. So what we're going to do is head over for our new area to explore. Well, there is a side mission. Oh, that's the entry. Never mind. Uh, let's see. It's over here. Like I said, we've already unlocked most of the places around here, so we can easily fast travel to it. Hopefully you guys are enjoying. Don't forget to leave a like. Remember, and I'm going to say this on every video, liking, commenting, sharing is very important, uh, especially for YouTube's algorithm. So that we are able to continue to grow on YouTube. So please, everyone, if you have a chance and you do like what you see, leave a like. It truly, truly helps. As well as comment. All of that goes a long way into making sure that that we can keep doing what we like. How do I stream in 4K on YouTube? I just uh, put the resolution to 4K and then I put the upload speed up to 20 megabytes and hit go live. It's, it's that simple. You just have to have a computer that can do it. Uh, and um, obviously uh, you running the game in 4K helps as well. Afton sent you. Whoever you are, I want to know why there's no king on East Anglia's throne. Because the man in question ain't been married yet. Once he is, East Anglia will have its king. And little else. Which man? Oh, you know, stranger, you interrupted a beautiful dream. I was sailing through Helheim, drifting on a ship of fire. Dreams of death often run ahead of the real thing. Oh, <laughs> wouldn't that be a bird? Did he just dream he shoulders? was Kratos? I'm just saying. What business have you with the backwater king, anyway? Danes from here attacked my clan. I want to know why and how to make sure it never happens again. Ah, that would be Ruid's clan. I killed the last man I put here, Adelstan. I suspect they'll do the same to our next monarch. A Dane who cannot keep the Danes in line? Not much of a steward, are you? If I knew how, I'd have rid our lands of them long ago. Ruid's clan plagues us all, Dane and Saxon alike. You are the sorriest soldier I've met in this country. Kick your king in the arse and fight back. He needs more than a kicking. He's got nothing he should have to win this fight. No courage, no army, no charisma. If he wants to live longer than a season, he'll need the backing of his bride's family, which he hasn't. They loathe the maggot. Who is he, your king maggot? Ah, uh, Oswald of Elmenham. He was King Edmund's council before the invasions. And like it or not, he's the last Saxon noble with any sway. 
Why not crown a Dane instead? Half done, y'all. Made it clear. You want a Saxon king married to a Dane for a greater show of unity. But Oswald's not the sort of man you'd chase into battle with a grin. He's soft. And the settled Danes don't trust him. Where is he now? I'll get the measure of him, see what I can do. <sighs> you just missed him. He's headed for Elmenham just now, pleading once again for peace. If you go by the north gates and along the road, you may catch him. I'm still noticing some really, really bad um, screen tearing. I don't know if you guys are seeing that on your screen, but I just don't understand how a game like this could have that uh, screen tearing, you know? I just don't get it. Doesn't make any sense to me. Like, the game runs... I mean, pretty smooth. I haven't had a single problem with it as far as uh, smoothness goes. There's no lag or anything like that, but why is it screen tearing? It doesn't feel like to me that it's dropping below... Um, it doesn't feel like to me that it's dropping below it 60 me. frames. Yes, I'm going to pet you if you let me. <gasps> Do you want to pet? No, you don't? Okay, whatever. They rushed in like wolves, killing and burning as they went. It wasn't us. You're f I built myself a home here. Ruid's clan attacked us as well. Oh, how nice to have a home to speak of, man. Mine was burnt to the ground years ago. And by whom, I wonder? Please, all of you, be we Dane or Saxon, we all want the same peace. With land to till and home to keep. Without fear of Ruid's violence. Till they break the peace with another bleeding raid. Nonsense. Their homes are here now. Same as ours. Are Danes attacking us, eh? What will you do about them? When I am king... <laughs> when I am your king... I'll set things right. You will be king when I'm a flying troll. You handled that well. Disputes between Saxon and Dane don't always end so cleanly. That was a clean result. A dispute ending without bloodshed is as clean as they come. Quite a brutal outlook. I am Eivor of the Raven Clan. Are you Oswald? I am. You're not here to kill me, are you? I am not in the habit of killing kings, but I do like meeting them. I am Oswald, yes. For as long as I can hold out. So what happened here, Oswald? A clan led by a Dane called Ruid attacked this morning. They've been sacking farms and amulets across East Anglia for some time now, growing more brazen by the day. Do they know this is Helfden's land? They must. They just don't care. Their chaos has touched my home as well. And I am here to see that it does not happen again. Lately, I've come to learn you are the hook that all hopes hang upon. As king, you could unite all Saxons and friendly Danes. A minor weight to bear, isn't it? Who else if not a king should bear it? Travel with me, Eivor. We can discuss my tenuous future on the road home. What begs your attention in Elmenham? Wedding preparations. Elmam is on guard as we ready my marriage to the Dane woman Valdis. She's a cousin of Hafton's. Good. A well-matched marriage can forge a strong alliance. So what's the hold-up? The hold-up? I don't yet have permission to marry Valdis. Her brothers don't approve of me. Oh, nothing, nothing big going on. Just riding my big wolfie. A dire wolf. Slow down. Something is not quite right here. Hold. There is smoke ahead. That's Beatley. It could be the same men who attacked at the walls of Norwich. Stay here. I'll have a look. This place is heavily guarded. Survey the area, Sunan. Unfortunately, it's not like it used to be, where you could literally take your survey, mark enemies, or whatever now.
What's that about? I don't know. Who is that mysteriously whistling in this direction? Straight in front of you. And you didn't see it. <gasps> Who could it be? <gasps> Who could it be now? Sorry. I'm just having too much fun today. Who could it be now? Something going on? Oh yeah, I heard that the Excalibur sword is pretty cool. Definitely gonna try to get it at some point. Whenever I get to that. Whoa! Let's flip there, bud. What is going on now? Don't be afraid, my friend. The bushies do not fight back. given to verse ah uh, their little worries their little lives they mean nothing to i want him to come over here so that's him. there he goes all right because i uh that's the one time that the whistle was too far away so therefore i couldn't whistle da -da 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 -da. i wish i had the double um air assassination but Watch this. Oh, they're back as to me. Oh, come on. first. It's like they set this up for me to easily be able to do this. What's the first? Hey! Stop. No escape! What? How did I you even see that? You. I don't even know how that happened. I know I was still in the trees, but yet somehow I still saw me. I will take my last breath. But why don't you take yours first? It'll be a competition. Let's see who has the last breath. I think it's gonna be you. That should be the last of these pig faced. There must have been an area. Yeah, there's an area right here. Oswald will be relieved to know of this. That's mean of the developers to put that tiny little area that I would go back in so I can be seen. Like that's just so weird. It's like <laughs> I'm stealthy. You don't see me. Ha ha ha. Alright, what do you got in here for me? Man, you know, it's been a while since I've played PUBG. I should uh, play that again at some point.
Ruiz clan. They left none alive. God rest their souls. I'm needed at home to make yet another fruitless attempt to impress my betrothed family. Show more grit than you're showing me now, and they may start to like you. Yes, sorry, I'm just shaken. If you joined us at dinner, that might ease their minds a touch. Think about it. My doors are open to you. I'll be happy to join you. Tell me when and where. Wonderful. Visit us in Elmham whenever you have time. It's worse here than I feared. Like I said, man, there are times when this game is just absolutely beautiful. Right? I mean, just feel the beautifulness in the air. I wish the, the controller would vibrate, like when you're riding a horse or something, as simple as that, you know, but... You don't feel anything. A healthy seeming town. This Oswald has done well for himself. I think I recognize the Fletcher. Look there. Alone Dane. Can't trust that. Shh. Be kind, yeah? As Christ would command. How did he beat me here? Oswald, where is this dinner you promised me? Eivor, you came! Dinner will still be served, but I'm afraid you are too early. My intended and her family are not ready. This intended of yours, Oswald. Who is she? One of love or politics? Her name is Valdis, and people don't marry for love these days, Eivor. This is an arrangement for East Anglia's benefit. She's from a Dane family whose military might is not to be trifled with, but her brothers... Their motives are selfish. Why don't you ever look around and come back later? Dinner will not disappoint. Oh, I'm sorry. I came too early, huh? I was just doing what you told me to do, which is to come straight here. And somehow you still managed to warp here before me. Have you been eating some of those mushrooms that my friend was talking about earlier? Hold on, I'm gonna unplug my controller and then plug it back in. I'm not getting any vibration of it. There we go. Is the game just not vibe? Like, it doesn't have. I don't know, man. See, that's the only thing. Is that uh, PlayStation 5 just has such a good haptic feedback controller? It's so great. Come, see my wares. What you got? All right, so we can keep. You would gear. look very powerful with that. But why this can't is we? The current fashion. Why can't we get um, like outfits? You know what I'm saying? Schematics for a settlement decoration. Oh, okay, I see what these are. I wish you could actually see what it looks like. You've made a great choice. You would look very striking with this. This is a very good piece. The new one there, Royal Guard. You never know when this might come in handy. I can't buy any because we're all full. Okay, so trinkets are things you don't need. So let's just sell all trinkets. Happy to take this off your hands. Yeah, that guy, that gave us a lot of things. Finish looking around. Nice, Michael. That's awesome, dude. There's so I'm much off. to do, right? You well, friend. There's a lot to do. Oh, we had a spammer in there. Sorry. Now look at this. Watch. You can go into here. Go over to where's the store at? 
think it's... Where is the store, by the way? There it is. Click on store, and then you can... Buy to your heart's content. See, what I really want is character and these outfits. I want a really, really cool-ass outfit. But it seems like the only time you can get a cool-ass outfit is if you have to, like... I don't know, like... It, it's not like the other Assassin's Creed games where you can easily uh, just get a new outfit. Notice how I only have 300 Helix credits, so all of this stuff you've got to buy. Uh... Doesn't say how much it is. This is a Ubisoft Connect one. But there's no price on it. Love the tattoos, though. I don't know. I'm just. Not a, um, not a fan with how they've done the, uh, those things in the game so far. You know what I mean? Yeah. Alright, well, let's go ahead and grab some, some things here while we're in this area waiting for darkness. So we're climbing from the other side. See what I'm saying? Holy misses it. Now look, I'm s oh my god, I just it's like they've they've screwed up the parkour so much in this game. It's not as fun as it used to be. was right here and it just oh i don't know man p i'm sorry listen i'm just gonna flat out say it anyone okay i'm not gonna say anyone because everyone has the right to believe what they want but in my opinion and this is just my opinion this is not one of the best assassin's creed games it is not it is a good assassin's creed game story so far i'm really enjoying gameplay is it's okay it's not the best but it's okay but it is not the best, and and I just don't understand people out there that say uh, this is the best Assassin's Creed game. We're gonna go ahead and meditate tonight. There's just so many glaring issues that I've had in the game, and it just I don't know. It just doesn't. Okay, now it's totally not. Yeah, we're skipping ahead, but in. Uh, I wonder if they'll say, wait till the, yeah, okay. So I think I should do it one more time and hopefully it'll be. I love the setting, but I just can't with a good conscience say that this is the best Assassin's Creed game or even close. Lords, ladies, 
This is a day of peace and fraternity. I asked you here to Elmenham to offer my thanks and extend my generosity. Finir, our steward, to our guests of honor, Brothir and Brode, and to my lovely bride to be, Grimhilda Valdis. You get to plow our sister because Halfton commands it. But you won't drag us into bed with you, you hear? Uh, bro, dear, that The is... last Saxon king we backed wasn't half as mushy as you, and we lost 150 men protecting his maggoty ass. Bro, dear. If you're going to be rude, then I must ask you to leave. This is my home. I won't be insulted here. <laughs> is that why you've come? To back this thane who smells of goat shit and cheap pebbles. <laughs> I'm sorry, did you say something? Do I bore you, Wolfkist? I'm here to protect my clan. If that means helping your king secure his throne, well, so be it. <laughs> You'd be safer crowning the throne. It's made of less wood than uh, this one. We'd all be safer if you had the stones to stand up to Ruid's clan. But between the pair of you, I can't see a single nugget. You watch your tongue, wolf kiss, or you'll find it freed of your face! So easily wounded by words. Imagine the ruin my axe would inflict on your flaccid ego. My flaccid what? Please stop this! You heard me. That's it! She called us flaccid! <laughs> Limp. Weak. Oh, great, Soft. it's one of those. I mean, I'm gonna lose. It's just the combat's so bad, especially the punching combat. Look at the animations. They're so awful. I hate talking bad about Assassin's Creed games. See, look, even when you punch them, you don't hit them. Did you see that? Look, I've hit him twice! Sitting there and it does not hit them. It doesn't hit them. It's just so. I'm, I, oh, I just cannot stand it. To be so full of vigor again. And then it's just. Oh, it's so bad. I'm sorry. I just do not like it at all. This is not how we settle disputes in East Anglia. See, I sat there, hit him, and it just does not register whatsoever. Calm yourselves. At least I'm getting somewhere now. They both do the same animation. Give me a break, game. It's so awful. Jeez. I'm sorry, I just can't keep my mouth shut anymore, you know? Like, I, I, I always try to, I don't know, make any type of game, I don't know, because I know all of the love that's put in, especially because this developer is so good, but I don't know what it is that just made this so bad for me, like, just not enjoying it. Look at that, did you see that? Can't hit him. And then he just can Oh my god. Look, you cannot hit him. I just don't get it. He's done. I mean, anyone that thinks this is fun, I'm sorry, it's, it's not. Stop! All of you! That's enough fun for tonight. If that's all you've got, it's little wonder East Anglia's in the state it is. You are weak, sheep herder. Your Norse friend here can't change that. We are better off without a king. Well, that's me, Don. I think I prefer dream nonsense to these alehouse brawls. 
What a waste of time and good mead. These brothers will never back me in my claim. This dance is just beginning, Oswald. Get some rest. You'll need your energy. And uh, will I see you in the morning? We have much to discuss, I think. I'll find a place to lay my head. And Eivor, if you can help me right this situation, you'll have a strong alliance with East Anglia. That much, I promise. Well, trust me, I know all about parrying. But in those situations, when it's red like that, and most of the hits that they would do are the red ones that you cannot parry, the ones where they grab you. Seems Oswald has set out for the day. I should have a word with him. Now, granted, I still like and enjoy this game. I really do. It's just there are just things about it that, I don't know, after the third game in this type of way that they've been making new Assassin's Creed games. It just doesn't, um... I need your eyes, my friend. I don't know. After the third game like this, it gets kind of Clear stale. Clear the mess in the longhouse and wake my brothers with the coldest water you can find. Eivor, good to see you. <gasps> ah! Good morning. Up bright and early. You can labor like a thrall, but you're no good with feasts. Not a good start for a king. No, indeed. I find a solitary comfort in my menial labors. Not something a king should admit to, I suppose. Yeah, story's great so far. The brothers shamed you at dinner. It's your duty to answer their insults. Don't let the matter lay unresolved. Oh, it was a petty row with henhouse wolves. I'd sooner answer the move a cow than worry about their insults. I have a wedding to plan and a kingdom to save. I haven't time to suffer fools. They betrayed your hospitality, Oswald. Where I'm from, that's a grave insult. Well, well. Here's the mud-soaked Saxon who's been taxing my patience. Ah, uh, Stuart Finnair. I know I failed to impress at dinner yesterday eve, but fear not. The Danes will come around in time. You stay claim to the throne, you dazed dog with no bone. If Lord Halfdown were here, he'd squeeze ale from a stone. Yelling, Finner, my dranger! Stick this cur in the ground! All mewling and spitting, here's Finnir, the hound. He has bark, but no bite, just a puppy I've found. <laughs> what just happened? That's flighting, Oswald. Using rhythm and rhyme to lay a man flat. Try it, match his verse. There's no man you can lead, you dunce of the thirds. Uh, a glutton you are. Just stop eating your words. Not bad. Not bad. Under all that tough posturing is a sniveling boy. So dig deep. When he brags, take a jab at his manhood. I've sailed squalls and north winds. You? Not even a breeze. But the winds that you sail... Blow between both your knees. Blow between both your... Oh, you mean farting. <laughs> <laughs> He's an ugly puss, so when he brags, hit him back with something about his looks. I hail from the north, where the winters are season. But you're foul. You're a blister. You're a... a... Plague-ridden lesion. Oh, yes, that's very good. Plague-ridden lesion. Attack his lack of wit, aha. He's got the wit of a boa, so when he insults you, make him feel stupid. When I'm done with you, cur, you'll be raven flock food. But your brain's soaked in mead, and your... Heads made of wood. Wood! Heads made of wood! Oswald, my boy, you're useless without your raven. This one's wrong for the throne. He's too soft and too tame.
Hit him back and make it personal. Attack his mother. When you crawl from the womb, you are ugly and lame. Your poor mother, she fainted away from the shame. Well spoken. <laughs> Your mama jokes clash, back in the early 900s. Huh? We destroy our enemies with well timed words. You have a talent for verse, I'll give you that. But how long will that silver tongue hold up against an iron axe? Let's find out, Finir. I challenge you to a home gang. You don't mean that, Oswald. That's a fight to settle disputes, no? A home gang. A fight to the death, yes. Let's talk it out, then. <laughs> Too late. The challenge has been made. But a fight against Finir would not be anything to boast about. You'll fight me. Hold on. This is... That said, I should not be seen killing a Saxon in the streets of Elmenham. There's a nice islet down river, near Seahenge. The water will wash the blood clean away. Prepare the square, and we'll meet you there. I hope you're ready. Oh, I have to be. Just give me a moment to mentally prepare. Do not make us wait long. It would not be kingly. So... I'm just gonna kill him? Are you ready for the home gun? I hope so. I just need to prepare. I'll meet you with the islet. He won't show up. Dire wolf. Come on. Why are you taking your time? Get over here. Ah, I can almost guarantee you that for those that have played extensively, like have beat both Odyssey and Origins, I think you're probably going to like this game less than those that maybe didn't really play Odyssey or really only played a little bit of Origins. Because then, if you've never played any of the other two, you're going to look at this and you're going to be like, whoa, this is awesome, you know? But if you've played the previous ones, then I feel like that uh, the, 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 the amazement feeling that you get is not going to be as much because you've already had that feeling with the other two. Yeah, so it looks like when you choose to let the game choose for you, I mean, the two. Because I remember them saying that you can switch back and forth. At least I thought they said that. But I could have been wrong. Maybe I was wrong. Maybe you cannot switch. Or maybe we're just not at that point in the game yet to switch. Look at that. We taught her. Uh, we taught our animal how to swim. So we can literally ride a horse across the... Or a, a wolf in this case. A, a, across the sea. made it. Now tussle with care. Go easy on the future king. He's the only man left who can claim the crown. Kings are made, not born, Finir. So let us see what we can make of Oswald. <sighs> Done. You still got the touch for drawing a square. He's got the touch! He got the power! Now. I'll always be a Dane. Must Sorry. we do this, Eivor? Strength and courage are always a boon, Oswald. You'll need both if you want the Danes to accept you as a king. True strength comes from resolve, Eivor. It speaks to us, a stern voice from within. I have never heard of talking guts, but a swift axe would silence that inner voice in seconds. You must be prepared. Wait, you're unarmed? Just do your best. I'll be fine. Can you guys hear me okay? Ah! 
We will forge a king out of you yet. Oh, so you can change. You just got to go to the Animus. Okay. Ah! Oh, was that too hard? It was a good strike. Keep going. Don't hold back. I'll battle you. You felt that one. I'm still here. I don't want to like... to believe this one will marry Baldis. Don't you think? It was almost too easy. If it's a fight you seek... You want me to fight? You expect the Danes to follow this pork belly? I'm... I'm still breathing, aren't I? Show me what you can do, Saxon. I'll do what I need to do. Come now! Inspire us, king! You'll never be king at this rate. Is this the best East Anglia has to offer? Yes, and I'll... I'll prove it! Come on, fight! Finish this, Eivor! It pains me to watch! I'll battle you. Should I let him beat me? I'm so confused. I'm not sure if I should let him beat me or not. the victor but you've shown us something oswald stay down oswald that's enough i will i will not stay down you fought bravely not with great skill but with spirit and courage always push back with everything you have even if you have to get dirty even if you must break the rules because there are no rules not if you answer a challenge head-on. That's where honor lies. Not winning the fight, but living through it. A seaside brawl won't change the brothers' minds. Oswald must show results. Redress old wrongs. Fight back against Ruid and his men. The raiders who attacked Beatley have a camp down the coast. The sooner we remove them, the better. That would go a long way to building you up. And if you brought gifts for the brothers, spoils from the raid, they'd be in your debt. Time to wet your blade, Oswald. Eivor, I expect your longship crew could help with this attack. You mean do everything for him so he doesn't have to do a dang thing and we win the battle and he gets all the credit? Yeah, thanks, Sam. Let's do it. No one has been willing to take a stand against Ruid's clan before. Or, or, We're or, a kingdom of or. farmers and merchants. Even farmers and merchants can fight when led by the right person. I hope your faith in pig farmers is not misplaced, Abel. There is work to do, yes. But we will rise to meet Ruid's clan. God will make certain of it. Time to get our raid on. Look! Soldiers dug in over there! Neither will we. Hey, come on, hit me. How did he hit me when he swung forward? There may be prisoners here. Keep an eye out for them. If I see any, I will let you know. Oh. 
Man, this guy really doesn't like to get hit hard, does he? Come on. Do something. That's a long wind up for nothing. Fight well, Oswald. Let the threat of death drive your blade further. Oh, ooh, I love that move. So Hang on to it. See, the combat can be actually pretty fun. If a bit simplistic, I don't know. I definitely still think that the combat in um, Origins, I think, in my opinion, was the best. Catch fire so quickly. Oh, here. Here. Damn. You're much better when you do that. What the hell? Where did this fire come from, man? It's so confusing. It's like, why is that little area right there on. I know people are throwing shit, but now to kill any stragglers. Eesh. Floaty McFloatle's team. I <laughs> like how they all follow me. I am the great and powerful Oz. Mm, I feel great. <clears throat> all right, looks like there's what? One left. He's almost dead. Nicely. Find something? There's a crate of hack silver here. More than enough to make everyone happy. We'll take it to the ship. A hard one fight. The first of many, Oswald. Have you the will to keep it up? See, some cutscenes just feel awkward. This is my gift to the brothers. I have more than enough wealth in Elmham to widen their eyes, but this will be a symbol of my commitment to our fight. It's a good start. Take what riches you find to know. Help us get 200 likes, everybody. Click that I'll like button. There. Say hello in the comments if you haven't yet. I'd love to get to know you if you've never commented before. That's what this channel is all about. It's all about getting to know others, feeling like uh, you're a part of a community. What? Find a key to unlock. All right, so there's a key around here. Oh, there it is. Oh, okay. I'll help. Which power did we unlock? The Magister's Cloak. Ooh. Could this be an actual, uh... 
It's a little different. I'm just getting tired of this big burly one, so we're going to switch to it. Let's get a rune in there. Let's get something. Um... Health. Now we're going to have a lot of upgrading to do because... Okay. Oh, you're kidding me. Look. That's so much better, like, period. We've already got it leveled up to four. Oh, that's right. I, I wanted something a little different. Uh, all right. So we got some more of these uh, to dish out. Let's go up here. We just unlock this new area here. Oh, well, I mean, we could get the warrior take. Oh, that's cool. Alright. So now we got a different cloak on. Let's see what it looks like when we have our actual... Oh yeah, see, nice and simple. That's a lot more simple than the big bear one, you know? Alright, where are we going? We're going pretty far away. You can see there is just so many things to do in this game. Look at this. We've only... This is only the places that we've been in, like, our 18-hour playthrough so far. Just here and here. I mean, that's just pretty freaking amazing. So, all right. Someone was talking about how you can... How do you go to the Animus? All right. So let's see. Options, credit, title, screen. So it's not there. I'm trying to figure out how to go to the Animus. I'm pretty sure pressing up. There we go. Change appearance. See, this is what I'm so confused about. It says the Animus will represent the stronger female or male memory stream depending on its current stream. You may choose another option at any time. Let's see if it chooses... Uh... No, it's still female, see? I just don't uh, understand. Let's choose male. Just uh, Let's try it. This will be my first time that we've actually done the male version. So, this will be a nice little change for us. Alright, let's head to our next mission. We'll do this next set of mission here as male E4. I'm still confused by this right here. This is set up to be a mystery down there, but I didn't see how we could do said mystery. We were down in there. Yeah, Michael, I turned it on. I wanted it to feel more like the original classic Assassin's Creed game, so I turned the assassination on. So we can assassinate pretty much anybody. This is Assassin's Creed. If I can sneak up behind someone and assassinate their throat, I should be able to do it no matter what their level is. You know what I'm saying? At least that's that's how I look at it. All right, so we're finally taking a look at male Eivor. Ivor. It's pronounced Ivor. Now, uh, we're going to stick mainly to female Ivor. 
Um, but we'll check out mail for like a few missions. Or something. I like the female Ivor. When I played the male Ivor in the preview events, I just did not like his character, his, 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 uh, his characterization of the male. I just didn't like it. So that's why I wanted to be female. But we'll I'll let you take a look at it here. Trophy from our slain enemy. What no battle dented Dane would ever follow this lump of lords into battle. I don't care how many shields he brings me. You mean to say you refuse my gifts, Broder? I don't have time for this. It's a generous offering, brother. You'd be a fool to turn your back. Refuse this and your shame will stain the name of your sons and their sons beyond. Stay out of this, wolf kissed. Take the gift. We have bigger problems. One of Ruid's men. Aye. Sniffing around the outer walls, looking for an easy way to slip a few dozen men inside. If there's one scout, there will be more. Something you might have learned if you kept him alive. I was passing water when he surprised me. It was either him or my plow sword. Baldus is right. There will be others. If I had seen any more, I would have killed them too. Where did you find this one? Just outside the Northwich Walls, by the water's edge. They will be looking for points of entry to sneak a herd of raiders through. Jesus. Find another scout. We'll question him. I'll look around. The rest of you stay here and out of sight. If I find anyone suspicious, I'll bring him here. Ruid scouts would be camped near their boats outside the city walls. Find and one of them will talk. defeat one of Rude scouts. They were seen near small boats around the walls of Northwick. They were seen near small boats around the walls. I'm guessing these are the walls, so we're going to have to start just... We spotted this one on a boat. If there are others, they might be by the river. Look for anyone suspicious outside the city walls. Yeah, okay, so I see what's is we're gonna go ahead and take this little boat here. Look at that, that's beautiful. So we need to take a left. You see, I don't know what it is, but I don't, I don't, I just feel like, a little close. I just feel like his, uh, Eivor's voice is not what the Eivor that I picture him to be. Does that make sense? Looks like one of Ruid's men. Ah, that hurt you. Ah! Wait, wait. What are you doing? I'm just a pig farmer. 
You are awfully well armed for a pig farmer. Stay down, muckworm. I have some friends who'd like to speak with you. Put me down! I tell you, I'm a cow farmer. Let me go, Dane. You said you were a pig farmer just moments ago. It, uh, it's not beyond reason. I tend to many livestock. You are as Dane as I am. Save your breath, liar. Liar, liar, pants on fire. See, I just, I don't dig his voice, I guess. I don't know, I expected uh, the male Evor to be a little bit more kind of, um, I don't know, dark voice. Lowered tone, you know? A baritone. Like, we all have those, like, the envision of what we would... I just, <laughs> I just can't. Oh man. Uh. Oh, this game. Uh. I just don't know. I don't know what to say anymore, you know? make that stuff up man they gotta do better with their animations with their hiding of certain things i mean come on it's breaking immersion like that you know <laughs> did ruid send you to speak now and you may live to see tomorrow Arger swine that won't make you any friends here a scolding like that is a mortal offense, boy. I killed the bastard. Don't give him time to act again. I'll ask once more. Why were you lurking around Norwich's walls? I came to pay my respects, Lord. To Oswald, the whimpering Saxon ergy of East Anglia. Tell him why you're here, and you may walk free with your head on your neck. Lick my dung hole. Here's the tongue I use for licking. How does it feel against your eyes? When the braziers lit at Dunwich, Ruid and his men will rally. They mean to attack Northwich by its weakest wall. <laughs> you English Danes are soft as butter now. Ruit sends his blessing, lady. He'll see you again very soon. He may still be of value to us if he... Any man who questions your courage and feels no shame, that's your answer. I will not have blood spilt needlessly in my kingdom. This has to end. Alive, this man was a risk. Valdis, this man spoke as if he knew you. Ruid was my husband. Your husband? You're married already? I was. We've been apart for five summers. 
I never expected to see him here. And I never wanted to. East Anglia's prosperity depends on our safety and unity. With Ruid's clan stomping around, neither is possible. I must speak with him myself, man to man. There's no place for him in East Anglia. He must hear it from me. Right. I'll start looking for a new king tomorrow. It was good to know you, Lord. Ruid will eat your lungs for supper, Oswald. Steer clear of him. If I'm to be a worthy king, I must meet the man who bedevils us. I'll light the brazier at Donich and face him when he comes. You sure you want to do this? Meeting Ruid in the open comes with many risks. It's the only way. We must face him head on, and we cannot waver. Come, Oswald. We make for Dunwich. And of course I will see the lot of you there as well. Else the songs of your cowardice will ring out over the generations. I'm sure you're heading to Dunwich any moment. We'll be there, Eivor. You don't speak for us, steward. Need I remind you, Wags, what Halfdown will do with us if East Anglia falls into Ruid's hands? See, there's just something about his voice that just doesn't uh, sit well with me. I just prefer the female Eivor, you know? We all have our characters that we like. And for me, I, uh, I really like the female Eivor. We have another quest right here. Ah, oh, it's the Berserker one. I am for return. Okay, so, um... Yeah, we'll go ahead and set it right. I think his look is really good. I don't know, just something about his voice just doesn't sit right with me. Although I'm 100% positive the, vo the voice actor does an amazing job. I'm not doubting that at all, but I don't know. Just there are certain characters that you you have that you feel are voiced a certain way. Like when you look at Ezio Auditori, like there's no way to imagine Roger Craig not being Ezio Auditori. You know what I'm saying? And just like with this guy, I just don't picture Avor being this voice. Exactly, Jim. I expect it to be more grovelly. Like, if you listen to, um, female Eivor, you can tell she's talking like something is wrong with her voice, you know, straining, right? I just don't feel it in his voice that he's doing the same. Nothing to see here. Just a wolf swimming. Cave should be close by. Now we're not doing that mission. That's not what we're here for. I don't want to accidentally start a quest. Following the East Anglia, I'm actually pretty excited to get to London. I'm, I'm really uh, uh, excited to see what, how London looked back in the you know early 900s or whenever this is taking place. Late is it late 800s or early 900s? It's around in that period. Like our rations are full. I almost thought this could be one of those areas sacrifices, but nope. Almost 200 likes. Help us get there, folks. If you're new, 
Damage. Say hello. Don't forget to leave a like. It is time to light the brazier. I'll light it. You do the talking. Ruther, Valdis, and I will scout the dock. Make sure there are no surprises. Oswald and I will hold here until the brazier is lit. The front gate is heavily guarded. You'll not be walking in. I'll find my own way. We'll be watching you back. Done, witch. Now to clear out Ruid's men and light that brazier. All right, so we oh, already see an inch of time. Guards it. Your eyes, my friend. <laughs> they put that on the wrong side. up there. So we made it here. I gotta look around. So it won't let, it won't allow me to light any uh, brazier until all of the men are taken care of, and it doesn't look like there's. Too many people, like, congregated together? Seems like this should be something that I should be able to sneakily and stealthily do. I come out here, there's these two guys there. And there's him. I left. There's a guy up there, there's two there. Again, we can't mark them, so... It didn't work. Crap. How did he see me? Get down, get down, get down. Your end is right here. I'm alright. Right. Sorry, that did not work the way that I wanted it to. I wanted to drop him, but for some reason the other guy just saw me immediately. I don't know how. Because he shouldn't have. Better keep alert. Hmm. 
Stacia. That shouldn't have been how it went. There's no reason why that guy would have just turned around all of a sudden. You know what I mean? Stay on your guard. What is he doing? I mean, come on. Hey! Might as well just get into it. I mean, it's so much easier when you just take everybody out like normal. You know what I mean? Literally just, you made everyone so simple. Especially on hard. Where the others are. Hey! Okay, there's somebody there. I just totally didn't see. No escape! I will gut you. Can't lose me. Shut up. That's so bloody, but awesome. I mean, you really don't have to do any stealth in this game whatsoever. It's not going to diminish anything. I may not have been able to stealth that person if I didn't have that specific uh, thing on, you know? My sincere thanks, friend. I mean, you just need to, you need something to explode this, right? I don't know exactly what, what is it that we need. It should be something as simple as... These walls will break with explosions, shooting an oil jar placed near the wall or throwing an oil jar. Guessing these are considered an oil jar. Oh, it's so dark to see. I can't. I can barely see right now, guys. Like it's so. Okay, well, let me grab this. Move. There we go. Okay, so that's the door, or the key that we got. All right. Nice. What do we get? Ability, ability, rush, and bash. Obviously, this is on the uh, right side. Oh, Russian Bash level 2. We need to make sure... Gotcha. We need to make sure that we actually run into something when we do that. Or else it really doesn't work. Yeah. Doesn't, don't, doesn't want to grab anything. There it goes. So finicky. I don't know who else is left, so let's just go around and kill anyone that we, uh, that we 
see. No escape. No rhyme, no reason. Uh, uh, you shit! See, when there's only a certain amount of enemies left, it'll show you where they are. Wait a minute. How did he not just die? No shader can save you now. Are you coming back up? Yeah. I'll wait for you, bud. Thanks for playing. One more left. It is much appreciated. That's the last of them. <laughs> Once the brace is lit, the rest of these men should arrive. Help! What? 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 Almost at 100. One Odin more, one or two more bargain. likes, and we got 100 a likes, guys. Thank you so much. My feet in exchange for a ripe East Anglia, and my wife returned. What a day! You, I don't know you. Any questions you have, you ask the king of East Anglia, and bend the knee while you do. Who called for me? Was it you, Valdis, my love? Why would I call you now? After five happy years away from your stinking balls. I called you, Ruit. You, Oswald, the hopeful king of East Anglia. And Valdis's husband-to-be. Take your men and go. East Anglia is strong with Saxons and Danes united. It will not fall to raiders. Thank you all so much. Must I set sail for Denmark with nothing to show for the journey after coming all this way? You'll have my weight in silver and an abundance of livestock and grain. I've taken ten times that already. What's the real prize? I'll make you an offer, Pigfoot. A home gang, just you and me, for the future of your kingdom. I accept. I accept a fight to the death. East Anglia's the prize. Let it be heard. Well, we know he's the hazel angry. is laid. The square is made. When you see a chance, lead Valdis and the brothers to safety. They must not fight today. East Anglia needs them. Let me be your champion. No. He called on me. Whenever you're ready, king of sheep shit. I'm ready. Call me 
Escape. Why not just fight? Should be pretty easy just to kill them all. Really, I gotta go back and help this guy. Oh my god, they're all down. right now. <laughs> this is sad that I have to get them all up like this. I don't know. It doesn't make any sense to me. Oh my god, are you kidding me? I'm so confused. Alright, can we run please now? Freaking ridiculous. Would you oh my god dude, do you or do you have a death warrant AI? I think they all fell down off that wall. <laughs> I believe it, man. This AI They're is breaking just... off. They've given up for now. Ridiculously crazy. I don't understand why we just didn't kill everybody there. That puts some distance between us. We can rest a moment. By Thor, he fought well. Raging like a bonfire. We should go back. I agree. Oswald may have survived. Ruid as well. It's possible. Ruid's men will press their advantage. We must be ready when they attack. We'll go to Norwich. Meet me there when you can. He died a hero, there's no doubt. If his god won't take him, all the sword women will. Elmenham will not recover. None of us will. All right. Raising iron, yes, I remember this quest. Okay. Specifically, this quest is, I mean, none of them are really significantly hard. There's no sound. Are you guys... Are you guys... Okay, tell me if you guys hear this horse sound. I do now. It's very, very... Small, but... The, it's like the sound effects are not very well mixed. 
listen, no sound. Very, very little sound uh, with the hoofing from the uh, the wolf. I don't know if it's because it's a wolf. But do you guys hear that? There's like nothing playing right now. I want to make sure I'm not the only one hearing that. Like the sound just doesn't, it doesn't sound like there's uh, I don't know. It's not loud at all. Like very quiet. The sound effects are so weird. Like almost it's like they, they don't make sense. They don't fit into the game. Yeah, probably Brandon's fault. I'm sorry, but it's, this is probably one of the worst launched um, uh, buggish Ubisoft games I've played in, in quite a while. Another king lost Abel. Stop washing your face with mead. How can I face half on y'all now? I've failed him again. I'm sure some of the devs actually look at my content because I've, I've I've been known for quite a while to be the type of walkthrough guy that I am. So I hope, you know, that they heed if they do, if they do watch a video or two, that they heed the, you know, they've they've got to do better. They've got to start releasing games that are finished and games that are less buggy. We can take the battle to what remains of Brood's clan before they hit back. Easier said than done. His men are holed up in Borg Castle, a fortress on the sea. On the sea? Then it must have a harbor. It does. Guarded by a gate of hefty iron held in place by timber spikes, difficult to force open. Timber burns. It does. But how do we reach it? We rig your ship with oil at her front and sail it ablaze at the gate. They would see us coming long before we reached the walls. We raise a fear. An army of East Anglia's farmers. Throw them at the front gate as a distraction. <laughs> Saxons willing to die for a bunch of Danes? It's a stretch. It can work, Finir. If they fight in Oswald's name, that is all the courage they will need. <laughs> you there! Did you hear of Thane Oswald's fate? Aye, we did. He dragged Ruin to the bowels of Elba, Dane devil. Ruid may be gone, but his clan still plagues East Anglia. And would you join us to rid your kingdom of his dogs? For Oswald? Aye, anything. Two eager Saxons is not yet defeated. But you may be right. We may have a chance. I can ride to Elmenham and muster what remains of Oswald's men there. But who else would join us? The Reeve of Thaedford, Winston. He's a bitter old barnacle, but he would fight to the death for this land. We can assemble a forward camp at the ruins north of Boer Castle. Ride with me, Finir. Let's pay this Reeve a visit. With any hope, Theovolt remains untouched by Ruid's violence. Hope is a scarce word in this kingdom. Maybe so, but I would rather hold on to something, anything, than ride with empty hands. If Ruid's clan continues to roam this kingdom unchecked, the people of East Anglia will be as ravaged as these lands. And where do we find ourselves? Riding into the fence to beg a horde of frightened farmers for aid. To fight for a king that you gave them, Finir. Remember. So, if anyone wants to know what's going on right now, we are literally at the beginning of the first preview event that I ever showed you guys. So, we're going to raid this little area. Um, then we're going to do the big castle thing. You guys should remember that from my original footage of the game.
We're now at power 80. Look at that. We're getting there, folks. We are getting there. We still need to find two. I don't know where to find those at. This right here. Rare material that can sometimes be found in chests. You just have to kind of wait until you can get some fabric. It was my task to find them this was the first Not footage I ever got to show you in Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Oswald wasn't crowned yet, nor was he married. I say you have some work yet to do. Right, right. No need to remind me how far I fell short. <laughs> what did you expect? Watch your back. Wood's clan may still be nearby. Feyavort, just ahead. Wood smoke and ash. Wood's men have been here. Watch your back. Wood's clan may still be nearby. Everything is gone, Reed. Everything. Ah, uh, my friend, we will rebuild, I promise you. I ain't got the strength no more. Stand? You have a will of iron coming here, knowing your kind did all this. Ruid's clan is your enemy, not me. I come on behalf of the late Oswald of Elmenham. You're still a Dane from top to two. It's your meddling that led to Oswald's death, leaving our kingdom for the worse. Yeah, they definitely have a little bit of uh, work they need to do on... Uh, I mean, the game's... This is still very interesting to me because I'm a huge fan of history. So all every Assassin's Creed game is always going to get me watching and wanting to play because I'm just such a huge history fan that I want to see these areas and these times. Even though we can never go there, at least we get to imagine that we are there. So that's one reason why I love them. Oswald was a friend and an ally, Reeve. He fought beside me and I by him. And look where that got him. East Anglia will fall if Ruid's clan is not defeated. Fight with me to drive them off for Oswald and your kinsmen. Pretty words, Dane. But the men of Theovard have their own battles to fight. If you need an axe, I'm standing right here. There's a village to the east, Kingsbury. It was taken by Ruid's men a fortnight ago. And I'll not rest until it's back in our hands. Let me and my raiders take the village. Save your strength and join us for the fight to come. A bold offer. If you do as you promise, the pikes at Theavard will be yours. I will take this news to our forward camp, Eivor. Follow when you can. I will see you there. Kingsbury's church has a great horn atop its steeple. If you manage the task, blew it. I'll know you kept your word. Stand tall. You there, Dane. A word, if you will. You called to me. We heard you talking with the Reeve, and we wish to fight beside you. We owe Oswald for his good deeds and fair rule. I'm glad to hear it. Go to the ruins north of Buch Castle. The army gathers there. Have you seen Mother? Oh, blessed. Your mother? When was last you saw her? Before the bad men came. She'd be right back, but she ain't. Oh. It just appears in front of me. Like I said, this should seem pretty familiar to you guys for those of you that did watch my original footage. But let's see if anything's changed or hopefully it's, you know, a little bit more polished, but... Now, again, you can... There's no reason I'm trying to stealth this. Just go up and raid. <laughs> there! A military encampment! I'd rather uh, take out these guys first up here. Die because of that. All these 
Oh my god. No! It's probably a good idea just to make sure that we've got... Wait, is that... Is that our big guy? We haven't seen him in a while. Wait, is that my... That is! There she is! So you remember the, uh, the warrior that I got, that I made myself? The one that's supposed to follow me? There she is right there. We do have kind of a big battle up ahead with uh, guys on the inside of uh, the, the church. He must be scared because he doesn't even want to hit me. I have that effect on the uh, enemies. Hey, do me a favor and uh, die. There you go. Oh, hey now. Hey now. Hey now. Oh, this is one of those. Oh god, I can't I can't move because I don't have any stamina. He took literally all my health because I have no stamina. I gotta back away. Go, 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 go. He literally took everything I have because it would not let me move because my stamina. Was obviously I've wasted my stamina, that's my fault. But jeesh, look at my health. And I don't think there's any. No food. And I got nothing. Yeah, this isn't gonna... I'm gonna die. There's just... I don't see a way for me not to die here. Yeah, that was just crazy. Like, did you just see that? Like, he gets into a fury, and if you literally have no stamina, you cannot move away. Like, you're just, you're stuck there. And your stamina is, uh, revolves around your shield. So, you can't block with your shield anymore. You can't do anything. If your stamina's gone, that's it. You're pretty much done for. Let's be a little bit smarter here now. Camp there, Eivor! Probably hostile. He's not. It's not that he's like that difficult to even take out. All right, good. He's dead. Bring them swords, sleeping. All right, we'll do a little bit better this time. Try not to catch on fire, but it's so hard not to catch on fire in this game. People just throw things left and right. What's my lead? 
Look at this guy. There we go. Alright. Alright, much better this time. The fire effects I'm just not really liking as much. Now watch. I don't think there is a way to stealth this at all. See? You're just automatically seen as soon as you come up here. You crawl soon enough! Oh, get him! See, it's not that he's hard. It's that if you just let him get close to you whatsoever, I mean, you're almost done for. But it's clearly not that it's hard. I mean, we took him out fairly easy if you let him keep it against Seven arrows left, though. Okay, we're going to need all the help we can get inside. Yeah, the exploding pots are ridiculous. Let's just go in. We got a huge battle we got to do in here. We'll do our best, of course. Um, let's see. What can I do? Uh, all right. Hey, come here. Nice. Oh, that took... Man, that almost took him out completely. Oh, that was so much easier than it was. Like I said, 
the combat can be fun, but more often than not, it's it's not as fun as you'd want it to be. But again, I'm just one person. I'm always going to give you my honest opinion on something. And that's just how I feel. Now, the others might not feel the same way. They might say it's the bee's knees. Everyone is entitled to, to feel the way they like about the game, but if you're any similar to me, then you're gonna you're gonna get a little bit of, of you're gonna get a feeling of something just feels a little off, you know. I want to know what. That means there's a, uh, a zealot around. to join me. Let's hope his promise holds. The horn! It's been so long since I've heard that sweet sound! Praise! I held to my oath, Reeve. I hope you will honor yours. My promise holds, I. The Ovord will join you in the fight against Ruid's clan. With your aid, we may yet save East Anglia. In past times, that horn was used to muster fears all across our land. You may find others who have warmed to its call. Good. Whatever willing men you find, rally them soon at the ruins north of Burt Castle. Raising iron complete. Fieldward has answered the call. I should join Finia in our forward camp. The Kingsbury Horn has inspired more than a few farmers to action. You did this? Aye. We heard the horn's call, as in times past. Are we to rise against Ruid's dogs? Theobald will rise. And Northwich and Elmenham. Then we will too. Oswald drew first blood taking Ruid down. We will finish what he started. We meet at the ruins north of Burr Castle. We're only hog farmers, but we'll fight as hard as we're able. Let's go. There's a long road ahead for us. See, setting things is the same thing. If you're near a body, you can no longer use your vision because it's the same button. If they, I wish they wouldn't set things to do multiple things like that. Wouldn't be as much of a problem. You see how there's just no sound? I mean, there's no sound effects. Like, I didn't turn sound effects off, people. There should be... You know, uh... You should be able to hear the horse. But you just don't hear it, you know? And it's so weird. I'll serve whoever pays me. One master's good as another. I guarantee if we were to put in Assassin's Creed, uh... Origins right now you would not be you would not be able to tell that those games are literally what is it? Uh, three years apart you wouldn't be able to tell
fellow adventurer need to know the lie of the land? There is the matter of my fee. All right. Look here. This spot I'll mark on your map. A place I know. What is this? I'll have to check that out sometime and see what it is. That horn came from Elmenham. Baldist must have got to them. The brothers' fleet, gathered and ready. Can we really do this? Ah, just finally. Watch out! Put my longship to youth. Thavor! Word of your actions in Thavor hey. has spread like wildfire. Men are pouring in from across East Anglia, and our ships stand ready. The Edward's Reeve is with us. His men will be here soon. More than his, the Kingsbury Horn has inspired men all across this kingdom. We will have the army we need. It seems Oswald got what he wanted in the end. Saxon and Dane united in common cause. A pity he is not here to see it. The forces will be ready soon. Are you ready to start the assault? I am. Our target is Burg Castle, said to be impenetrable. Good. Let them have their false confidence. By cover of night, Baldus will lead the field at the front gates. With Ruid's men distracted, our forces move on the sea gate from the backwaters at their backs. And once we're in, we'll leave no gate closed in that castle. Ruid's men cannot be allowed to dig in further. Your longship, is she ready? She awaits her own special glory. They need your words, Eivor. This is a battle for freedom! For a long time you lived in fear. Your house is raised, your fields scorched. Now, your chance has come. Fight to be free of this pain. Fight to be free of fear. Freedom! Freedom! Now is the time. Today, we rid East Anglia of Ruud's clan once and for all. It's a montage. We need another montage. We're gonna take him down, yeah. Cause this is a montage. Sorry. You remember the dream I spoke of? You sailed through Helheim on a ship of fire. Here, it may come to pass. Dreams. Life. Maybe they are one and the same. Tonight, I ride the flaming sea steed. Rushing for the spear then, a watcher light on water's wake, another glory I will keep. Oh, I wanted to see if we could do the uh, cinematic view, but I guess we can't.
Ready yourselves. Ruid's shit stains will see us coming. <laughs> shit stains. What's wrong with you? Get out of my way! I'm bolting here! I'm on a boat. Steady! Hold course! Ready yourselves to brace, men! We bring Helheim to our enemies! How nice! They greet us with some of their own from the air! Arrows! Brace! Odin's hell! May the sword maidens take them swiftly. Thank God Keep that this boat isn't made of wood, because fire doesn't burn wood. Yourself, right? Steady your hands. Hold for impact. The smell of battle. Forward! Get that ram in place! We need to open these gates! Charge! For Oswald! We'll treat the ravens! Oh. Put that glorious oh. ram to use! Ruined stocks are on the bar! Prepare to cut them down! This is for Oswald! You come and die on my blaze! See, I hate if I'm around a body, I can't do that because I'm trying to look for. Oh, you guys, you're hanging on the wrong door. Oh. 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 
Oh wow, there he broke too. They take a long time, dude. They really do. Oh, thank you. Oh, this guy's floating. He's a floater. We got a floater here. Okay, it looks like I'm gonna need to be the one that does this, because I don't think they're ever gonna be able to do it. Come on. You're so close, but here, let me help. Let's go! I need help! Oswald. He lives. Oswald lives! Is that you? Shut your ass, twig spine. <clears throat> Stand fast. This will be over soon. Worry not for me. You must stop the <clears throat> silence, fool. So this is what it comes to, Wolfkist? Two Danes fighting over a filthy Saxon horse, son? If this swine is your prize, come and <clears throat> get him. <clears throat> Don't mind if I do. All right, so if you're good enough, I think... The people of East Anglia have spoken, but give yourself over. Taken prisoner to assassin? To you! Now you just have to fight the wolf. Thank you. You'd throw in with these wastrels? These Argir swine? For what? A scrap of land and a promise of peace? Eivor, no! He should be tried before God. A lawful assembly. <laughs> I won't have my reign begin with more blood spilt than is needed. Another screeching skull. 
This man must die for the damage he has wrought. The old laws are clear. These are Oswald's lands. To rule as king as he sees fit. Does Eivor bow to kings? To defy a king would shame him. East Anglia cannot heal without his honor intact. And what of your honor, Eivor? How much are you willing to lose? What do you guys think? <clears throat> I want to know your guys' opinions. Should we allow him to live? Or shame him to die? So, I don't know if this has any effect on the ending of the game. But the way of the Viking is pretty much going to be at an end. So, I'm leaning towards the way that I would normally choose. Which is always to be the bigger man. The better man. And uh, I think I'm going to let him live. I'm going to I'm going to rule with the king. king of East Anglia has spared your life today. And so it will be. Compassion is a virtue suited for anyone, Eivor. Including you. Thank you. Right, we want, we want these people on our sides. I should speak with Oswald. Right. See if he's well. Points finished to the ships. Praise the old father. Oswald lives. You fight well. Thank you for heeding me, Eivor. I know the worth of such a gesture. All this is, is like a dream. But you are not asleep. Well fought, well fought, the both of you. You came as well, old friend. If I'd known you were still alive, I would have stayed in Norwich. Look around you. A happy occasion and a glorious victory. And soon, something more grand to take place. Our wedding, my love. If you will still have me, that is. And why would I not? I fought poorly. I melted under the heat and anger of that brute. And I never... Oswald, stop. You fought with all your heart and soul. That's all you need ever do. Come then. We have much to prepare for. A bride to wed and a kingdom to lead. What some men wouldn't give for such things. Countless men have died for them. And you, Veneer? Are you jealous of such things? Hardly. My heart is afire, but my body aches. I desire only a long nap. I saw a bale of hay back there. Later, Abel. For now, I must see to the wounded. Then I will see you at the wedding. Aye, of course you will. I should return to Elmenham. Oswald's wedding will soon begin. Mm, all right, wedding horns. You see how easy that battle can be if you actually stealth him? Which the game really just gives you a very easy way to do it. However, if you went at him straight on, you'd have to fight both him and the wolf. And let me tell you, that battle is hard. All right, so we got some gold in, or something in here. Let's figure out how we can actually get in there. Hopefully it doesn't tell me, you need the key to the castle. <laughs> oh, this is one of those brain busters, right? You see? Huge brain buster.
again, you your choices do matter in this game. So obviously me choosing to save and listen to the kings is probably going to make Sigurd think that I am going against the Viking way. And that's why we're going to have a fallout with Sigurd. And, and that's what's going to change the game. It's going to be changed. The game will be completely changed. Sorry, I don't know why I went in the trump there for a minute. But you see what I'm saying. I don't know. I wish that they did it a little bit more of a meaningful way than that way. Um, all right. So we've played Mel uh, Eivor enough. So we're going to switch uh, back to... See, for some reason, the stronger version is the female version. I always let it pick for me. And it picks the stronger uh, female version. All right, so where are we headed? Here. I solved a puzzle. Look at that. Thank you guys so Waiting much for all the likes so far. I appreciate it. You guys are awesome. I think our goal should be every single stream that we do. We should try to go for at least 100 likes and get more if we can. The more likes we get, guys, all I can say is the, the more chances other people outside of this community will be able to see these videos. And that is very important. As much as I love having all of you here that have come back time and time again, it's also important that we continue to grow and grow as a community. And the only way we can grow as a community is to spread the word. So keep that in mind. Always, always, always spread the love of Sinistra No One Gaming. There's a few uh, cool activities we get to do here, like the drinking mini game. We can uh, have uh, relations. We can have relations. I did not have relations with that girl. But we could have relations if we choose to in this game. Eivor! I'm so glad you've made it. And I did not inhale. Count on me, Eivor. I'll show you and the gods my I will be patient for honor and glory. Just like you to keep a king waiting at his own wedding. Yet I arrived in the end. A part of me worried you wouldn't. I told you I would see you crowned, and now here we are. Without you, I'd be dead. Another wasted hope for East Anglia. You look good, Oswald. Like a man about to marry a more powerful woman. Do mm. I? Because I'm nervous as hell. Of all the battles a man can fight, the war against himself is the hardest to win. Yeah, we need to do that, don't we? We need to have more more live chats on uh, Discord. And if you haven't already joined our Discord, make sure you do that. The link is in the description, discord.gg slash centerstrain01. It's where the whole community, get, community can get together and just talk about love of games. Gee, that's a mustache. That's correct, Martin. Martin knows what it's all about. He's a smart man. Simba. <laughs> nice decoder ring. I 
here by name you man and wife. And as man and wife, I name you... Oswald of Elmenham, first of his name, the rightful king of East Anglia, with his Lady Valdis, soul, fist, and beauty of this land. You've done it, Stuart. A king now sits on the throne of East Anglia. Don't leave yourself out of this song. We did it together. Back to your dreams, then, of fire and Helheim. I lost my way some time ago. Hard to say when. I don't want to be here. I never did. This was half Dan's dream. He ordered me to see it through. In my dreams, I'm sailing, remember? Wind in my beard, salt on my lips. I want that life again. Whether or not I find it, only time will tell. Until then, let us feast, drink, and forget our pain! <clears throat> Alright, so we have a lot of, uh... ...fesh to get to. Skull Ivar! Let's have a drink! Your fist is without ale. Let us address that. Surely a special kind of metal is required for drinking before the new king. A metal not unlike your own. To Odin and his endless glories. And the new king of East Anglia. May his reign be long and good. Not bad, wolf kiss. I wager you couldn't drink more than me if you tried. <laughs> A fool's wager. A challenge nonetheless. What say you? I say I. I will drink you under the table. <laughs> Confident, are you? Let us see how you fare against the ale beast of East Anglia. And we'll make it interesting. Put your silver where your mouth is. What say you? I accept. Do not fail me, strange. Yes, Skull! Drink more! going to start. Yeah, the hardest part is getting <clears throat> the slow part down. Because it just goes so slow. See? And then you gotta hit it at the same time. He's all—he's oh, beating me big time now. Gosh. <coughs> I lost. Wow. He beat me. You can't make any mistakes with him, I guess. This hell is strong, brother. <laughs> but I am stronger. Better luck next time, Wolf Kissed. Now, you owe me some silver. Fine. Take it. Oh, that sucks. I usually do so much better, but when you gotta press the left thumbstick, then you still gotta wait for the timing. I mean, it's it can get quite uh, hilarious. The boar represents fertility. Did you know that? Estes Freyr, what's your point? You impress me, Eivor. Your battle wisdom. Your strength of character, 
skilled in so many ways. Yet I wonder, is there any skill of mine that I could impress upon you? Even a fool has something to teach, whether they're aware of the lesson or not. Hey, hey. But I could show you how to wield my plow sword. Be plain about it, Stiff Spear. You want to lay with me, is that it? That I do. Will you follow me? To a place more comfortable? Sorry, friend. I am here for mead and merriment, nothing else. Wait, did you hear? Did my brother just call me? I think he... You know I should go. Brother! Now, we, uh, we did lay last time. But no, he's after seeing more of how he was at the beginning of these missions that I wasn't able to see before. I decided that no, I do not want to uh, give myself to him. Although I could have given myself to him and then stole his money. That way we would have got our money back. Eivor, care for a challenge? Eivor! Wolf kissed. Gaze upon my pots. They stand so strong. Unbreakable at this distance, no? They are not, Brothier. My arrow shadow would have a target they strike. Even after draining so much meat, succeed and you shall be rewarded. <laughs> Keep your eyes open long enough to witness me, you drunken lout. She stormed Bull Castle. Brought Ruid to his knees and let Oswald hold him for trial. I could hardly believe my ears either. Yes, that's it. As with everything, an easy task for the wolf kissed. Ah, oh, barely a challenge. Impressive, impressive. Here as promised. Now go enjoy the party. Well, we got 50 of our silver back. Eivor, Eivor! Some sweet wine for a sweet swine? Join me! I'm trying. Oh, the parkour has just gone downhill, in my opinion. So bad. <laughs> the Saxon god wanders somewhere up here, does he not? I haven't seen him. They like to say he moves with mystery. Look! The moon! It moves on trouble now. But one day it will be eaten by a giant wolf and the nights will be black forevermore. Are you all right? I've tasted glory once again. And it was good. I'm glad to hear it. Now... I always felt like Skull or Hati. Chasing and trying to fulfill Halfdan's wishes. But now I've caught my sun and moon. I've got them and I... I don't know. You can let them go. Sail to a further shore. My longship's in Valhalla. Oh, don't you remember? Fire starter. <gasps> Come on. Let's get you to solid ground. Everything spinny. You're very strong. You, you're very large. <gasps> it just drops him. <laughs> Sorry for this, Eivor. I've had one last glory. I should be happy. I am happy. Thank you. It need not be the last. Not the last. <laughs> mm. 
Enough fun and games. I should see how Oswald is doing. Eivor, I'm about to address our guests, and I'd like you to be there. It has been a worthy ceremony so far. And have you had enough fun yet? I am ready to hear you address your kingdom. Good. Come, come. Join me. Thanks, uh, does this go? Friends, and yeah, we're guests. going we're going at least for three we hours. We've pushed yeah. through hard times. It seems like all we've known is loss and suffering. But it is not conflict that binds us. It is compassion. May we always favor compassion, even when our enemies refuse its boon. So to my Dane friends and neighbors, I give thanks for the bravery you have shown during our collective struggles. And for my fellow Christians, may we continue standing as examples of our Lord's grace. Lights in the dark. I see East Anglia's future right here, right now, in all of you, Dane and Saxon alike. To our future. Still a bit soft on insults, but the king has courage. And to Eivor, without whom none of this would have been possible. On behalf of East Anglia, let this ring be proof of our loyalty to the Raven Clan and all they have done for us today. Would you have any words of wisdom for us? I'm going to Disneyland. Oswald, you would not have been my first choice as king, nor my second. I thought you weak, bendable, without resolve. But not all men are as they first appear. I came to see that Oswald's heart is amongst the largest I have ever known. He is sturdy, he has wisdom, he has courage. All qualities of a man worthy to be king. He is the king East Anglia deserves and the king you need. To the good king, Oswald! To Oswald! Skull! 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 Okay, everyone, the bridal race starts now. Remember, you all have to lose to the bride and groom. Steady all, and ready yourself for the wedding race. The king and his bride against all. My king, he... <laughs> the sheep you left to guard me have been shorn. Oswald, king of sheep fuckers, show your eyes. I challenge you. I accept. I'm going to I'm going to say that he can do this. Oh, I don't know. What do you guys think? Should I fight for him or should I say that he can do this? I have no clue. I don't remember. I want to believe that Oswald has learned and he's done better and he's done good. But at the same time, a king should not fight. I mean, a king does go into battles, but he should not fight like this. So, what do you guys think? Should I let him do this on his own? Or do I fight on his behalf? I'm going to wait and let you guys um, help me with making this decision. Fight for him. Oswald is king, and a king must have a champion. I will fight in his stead. He challenged me, Eivor. Your fight is bigger than this, Lord. You must rebuild East Anglia plank by plank, and a dead king cannot keep his oaths. Let me finish this. Oswald, you gutless Arius swine! I'll slay the wolf kissed, then hang you with your own tongue. If 
you. Always getting in the way. Oh, how did that still hit me? I backed away from it. Oh, really? Yeah. He always gets a hit once you try to hit too many times. See what I'm saying? Otherwise, it's not really a tough battle. Oh, you could have said trap. We should have not come to this. So much death, so much anger. What is done is done. You're leaving now. I should. Your wedding should be a day of peace and happiness. Today I lack both. Eivor, you've done East Anglia a great service. I promised you an alliance, and now you have it. And one day I will need you to make good on that alliance. Now remember, if we would have just killed him, I should find Finier. That wouldn't have been there, right? Before I leave, like, because we had the choice to either kill him or follow what the king said, and we decided to go ahead and uh, follow what the king said. I wonder if that would have changed at all. You'd like to think that it would change. You'd like to think that, obviously, if you already killed him, or that you would have had the chance to kill him because you made that choice. But games sometimes fake you into giving you a choice, making you think you have a choice, knowing that you really don't have a choice. Knowing that you'd have to go back and play it again to see what the other outcome is, which a lot of people won't do. So they think the choice that I made was a real choice. I don't, I'm not saying that that's how it was, but... I just wonder, if anyone's played it differently, did you kill him before? Did he stay dead and this fight never took place? Did you have the king fight him? And did the king die? Did the king live? Let me know in the comments below what happened uh, with you all. Brother, look after Oswald, will you? Aye, he is family now. And I could not be more proud of him. <laughs> we have you to thank for that. <laughs> Take care. Brother, Oswald is in your hands now. Protect your king, and call out to my banner should the need arise. Aye, Eivor. Without a moment's hesitation, travel safe. I will, friend. Valdis, will you not stay a moment longer, Eivor? I should not linger. My banner folk await my return. I understand. Take care, Valdis. You fought well and won yourself a worthy king. I did, didn't I? Take care, Eivor. I thought someone said that you can actually speak with her. Thank you, or, Eivor, for making to I mean, you can sleep with her. Did I say speak with her? I meant sleep. Because I didn't get any options to even try to sleep with her. dream come true like none other thank you for everything from the bottom of my heart ah greetings Eivor oh my god you're missing oh the festivities my... oh my god I've had my fill it's as much yours as it is Oswald's I was a crumbling man Eivor before all this I thought I'd die a tired old failure but now, my heart burns bright with newfound fire. I want to live hard, die fierce. Glory cares not for age, Finir. Sail with me. My ship could always use a wise head and a strong axe. Together? Together. I'll gather my things.
There we go. The good Saxon. It seems the wind calls me back to Ramley. Best tell her the good news. All right, so you're saying that we did another order, right? It's not showing him. No. It's it's literally not showing him as uh uh See what I'm saying? No. He was not part of our Order of the Ancients, or else it would have shown in here that he was killed. Unless we just don't know that he's the Order of the Ancients yet, or something similar to that. What a celebration! <laughs> Really? I didn't know that. Thank you, ghost. Very interesting. Collect your tribute as the... Oh! So the one that I created, others could join so we can collect... While you were away, your Joms Vikingar helped to serve other Jarls. Here is the tribute they earned. Nice, a hundred silver. I'll see you later, friend. I almost wish I would have let him fight. But then again, you have to think about it this way. A king Hello, does Eivor. not fight. That is not the king's purpose. The king's purpose is to unite and bring people together and to be the, you know, the head honcho. So I felt if I, I, the king should not be the one just because that means anyone could go up to a king, any piece of crap and say, I challenge you and the king's going to accept it. No one will fight for the king. I mean, come on. It doesn't make any sense. So I think it's better that, yes, that, uh, that Eivor fights because that's, how it should be. Eivor, thank Tyr. I heard shouting. Is something wrong? Holgir robbed me, and I demand he be punished. Ha! Huh. Rob disappointed word? Does the deer rub the stream when she takes a drink? Does a cow rub a field when he crops on sweet grass? Eivor, this matter requires sensitive judgment. Will you? Of course. From the beginning, please. Well now, there is no excuse too small, I see. Nothing to keep you from coveting that seat, is there? In Sigurd's absence, who has better claim to oversee these disputes? You might leave them to work it out for themselves, but that would mean letting go, would it not? Please start again. Tell me all that has happened. I will start. I have been falsely accused by this Saxon Philistine. A Philly what? Are you mocking me? Silence, please. I'll hear both of your complaints and render a decision, awarding compensation if needed. Understood? Rowan, tell me your version of these events. Huh. As you are aware, Holger and I are neighbors. Near enough that I often catch him at my stables, stealing my tools. Borrowing. Holger, let him speak. Stealing, borrowing. My point being, I have always allowed him to use whatever he pleased. I greatly admire your Norse generosity and had hoped to match it. 
but this morning, Hogear stretched the limits of my grace. Entering my stables for their feed, I found my most beautiful, gentle mare stripped of her tail. Bereft, not a strand in sight. I am ashamed to say my natural suspicion drew me to Hallgear, and how right I was. For when I peered across the lane, there he was, gripping a horsetail brush slathered with indigo, dragging it across a sheet of painting, Rowan. I was painting. You make it sound so crude. You see? Such willful arrogance. It will take ages for Ilgafu's tail to reach its former length. I demand compensation. I understand. Thank you, Rowan. Holger, let me hear your sight. Eivor, you have known me as a skald for years. You have seen how my poems bring life and joy and wisdom to our people. And you know that my work requires a certain, let us say, freedom. To make use of rare resources to compose my verses. Often, when lacking the proper tools, I have made use of novel items. Alvis's walking stick, Tovi's inks, all were given gladly. You cut off my horse's tail to make a brush, you bleed- Rowan? As I was saying, this morning, in the throes of poetic reverie, I realized that my latest piece required delicate brushwork. I could have used a frayed stick, some cloth, my hands, but no. I needed something gentler, softer. To make a perfect brush, I needed the fine hairs of a well-raised horse. And so I availed myself of a local resource. You clipped Alfgafu's tail to the rump without asking. It was early. I did not wish to wake you. Thank you, Holger. I believe I understand your position. I believe I have heard enough. If you will... My horse looks like a fool, Eivor. No handsomer than a donkey now. You must do something. Do not conflate hair with beauty, Rowan. She remains radiant. Elgifer's hair will grow back in no time. Quiet, both of you. Now listen. I mean, who do I side? What if I don't want to side with either of them? Before I give my verdict, I would like to hear your statements again. No, I don't. I don't want to decide with either of them. I believe I've heard really. enough. If you will, my horse looks like a fool, Eivor. No handsomer than a donkey now. You do not conflate hair with quiet, both of. You. All right, so this is a tough choice. So let's think about it. I guess. Um, all right. Oh God, I forgot who is who. I need to listen to this Before again. Before I give my verdict. Rowan was the first guy, right? Okay, so Holger is the guy on the left. Rowan is the guy on the right. I believe I have heard enough. <laughs> if you will... My horse looks like a fool, That's Rowan. Eivor. Okay. No handsomer than so a... So here's, here's the defense I have. Beauty, Rowan. She required both... So Rowan is technically right in the situation. He has been generous in allowing him to take the tools that he needed or whatever with no muss or fuss. However, a horse is more than a tool in these times. A horse is livelihood. It is, uh, uh, it is earning, it's, it's money, it's, it's, it's important. And he took something from the horse that he shouldn't have. That is something that you should say something about, okay? Exactly. He should have asked first. Don't give me the whole waking up thing or whatever. Holger should have asked first. Um, and Holger's defense. No, he doesn't really have a defense. I'm sorry. I mean, if you don't have no, you don't have a right to go around and take uh, and cut the, the fur off of a, of a horse, the tail off of a horse. You don't have the right to do that just because you want to express your art in a way that no one else does. So I'm going to go with uh, Rowan. Because I feel like Rowan uh, is is in the or Rowan is in the right, Olger is in the wrong. Even though I like Olger more, because he seems to be more of a, a good character, whereas Rowan seems to be more of a complainer. 
um, Rowan is right, unfortunately. So we're going to go with Roland. Even if Holger is supposedly a better friend, being a good king is not about having friends. It's about having, uh, it's about doing what is right. Holger, Rowan is clearly in the right. You shared the tail from his horse without gaining permission. I borrowed the tail. Borrowed. Does the reality of regrowth not make this a victimless crime? It is a two-victim crime, Holger. Though they are unharmed, you took without asking, and that will not do. As the horse's value has diminished significantly, you will pay Rowan its market price. But the horse was not for sale. Rowan, admit it! My decision is final, Holger. Pay what you owe, and meet tomorrow as friends. And if I do, may I keep the horse? Pay the man, and be done with it. Rowan, does this satisfy you? It does. Thank you, Eivor. Good. Then by Tyr's blessing, let this matter rest. We are done here. Return to your homes in peace. We got our first... Would you allow me to pay you with a vibrant painting? Oh, God. After all, in some ways, you helped in its creation. Absolutely not. Silver is the only color I wish to see from you. I mean, those are some of the things that you got to deal with when being a king, you know, or a queen or whatever. But let me just sit in the chair again because it felt really good. Yeah. Tis nothing but a game of thrones. Ha 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 ha. Sorry. Oh, hello, Eivor. Good day. That Holger, he is quite the character. I almost envy him. To see the world through such a muddy glass and live with such petty concerns. He has no care in the world. Let's not walk too far with that idea. I need you right where you are. East Anglia is with us. Their King Oswald has pledged his loyalty to us. Eivor Kingmaker, we shall call you soon. Some interesting news. King Cheolvulva sent Cheolbert to Shropshire. He hopes to install him as Elderman there. Good for Cheolbert. He should do well considering all he has learned from you. I gave him only a taste of my knowledge. The rest he will need to figure for himself. One more thing. I do not know if you heard, but Sven passed away a short time ago. The poor man slipped away in his bed. I had not heard, no. And how is Tovi? She must be gutted. It has been rough on her. She spends quite a lot of time at this burial mound. Why is it going Speak in and out of focus? Her, if you have the time. And who? I don't even remember who the hell Sven was. See, that's what I'm saying. You got to have characters that really make you want to remember them. And I'm sorry, but I literally oh, do not gosh. remember. So glad to see you. Who the heck fire Sven was? Does that make me bad? Yeah, probably. All right, we got some skills, and they're multiplying. We're level 80 right now with six skills, and we're almost at the point where we can tackle Asgard, because they say you want to be a level 90. Um, you know, to uh, tackle that, that mission. I don't really need the advanced assassination. The tattoo guy. So, oh. Our tattoo guy is gone? Well, that sucked, diddly OCOs. Well, guys, we made it to level 86 now, so we're getting super, super close. Where's my tattoo shop? Cast about this land, my friend. Oh, we haven't built it yet. 
We don't have enough. What's that second mission? Ben has passed away, leading Tove adrift in guidance. Let's see the quests here, real quick. I think soon we're going to be heading to Oxenford and Glowish to Shire, as well as uh, there's Lunden. Is that how they actually spelled it back in the day? Lunden? There's the Thames. Essex. More side missions and whatnot. You can see we've barely yet even uncovered this entire map this game is just so big but it does not look like we can actually go back to um norse or uh we can go back to where we first when we first started the game it doesn't look like it i just noticed that there is one right here we haven't grabbed so why don't we actually grab this real quick i know it's quite a distance away but Let's grab this. It's not letting us follow where to go to this thing. Maybe because there's no way to get there. Now, if I'm not mistaken, I think they also say that it's a good idea to go out of the Aminus or um, Aminus every now and then to uh, talk to Sean and kind of just do a little bit of the real world, I guess. So after we view this viewpoint, let's take a look at the outside Animus world, the actual real world. Not what I wanted to do, but... Okay. church. There's someone there. <clears throat> Thor lends me strength. Mm, scraps and rags left for the rats. to the one true king of briars. This throne of Mac and Manure. I suppose that makes you the Lord of Shitsby. <laughs> How dare you insult the brave and valorous soldiers of... Of Shitsby. Yes, I know your type. Insolent spirit! Kill this usurper! We 
will fight for this muddy kingdom, tooth and nail! No way, you Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh my god, I can't move. Yep. This must be out of our, uh, this must be, uh, it's out of our area. You know what I'm saying? Like the, the power level. So it, did you see how it took all, when we used our special, um, ability there, it took literally all of our, uh, stamina. We had no stamina. Uh, hard stone. The stench is ripe. You! Uh, we'll still do this. This uh, we'll try it again. ferret! Kill this usurper! What the hell? We will fight for this muddy kingdom, tooth and nail! God, I hate that. <laughs> Don't let this one escape! No one defiles this sacred throne and goes unpunished! All right, I still think we can do this. Whoa! Come on, then. Nice. I did not expect the dog to do that. What happened there? Oh, they weren't that hard to take out after all. The thrall of an absent king. Pitiful. I am now the king of Shitsby. I've always wanted to be the king. Why not the king of Shitsby? So isn't that that ability that we got, right, to have the dog help us out? I wonder what made the dog help us out. I don't know if I pressed a button. That... Oh, I see the chest there. Got it. Hope I have an arrow. Well, let me do it. Hold on. I mean, do you even need that when you can just do this? <laughs> yeah, I don't think you can get up there like that. All right, so we'll just climb it the old fashioned way. Just 
I'm just not a fan of the magnets anymore, man. I'm just so, so tired of the same old way that Assassin's Creed does its uh, parkour anymore, you know? It's just, this way is not fun anymore. So really, I hope that over the next few years when they revamp this series, that they figure a way to change it up and make it a little bit more, uh, more fun. Hey, will not jump. She, she just shakes her ass. You won't jump up. Now she, it just, it's so finicky. Don't forget, if you haven't yet, leave a like. It helps the channel so, so much. But, all right. So we've done that, we've synchronized that. See, this level is 160, wow. It's way, no wonder they were way out of our level. All right, so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna get out of the Animus. Um, I don't think it'll let us do it from here. I think we gotta jump down first. <laughs> It really will not let us get to the Animus unless I'm reading it wrong. There it goes, okay. Exit simulation. Just wanna to talk to some of these out here and see if there's anything of any importance. I'm gonna to try to record more Call of Duty today. We'll see if that works. I don't know if they fixed the game yet or not. I said this this modern day just has not been fun at all since Assassin's Creed 3. Granted, I enjoyed Assassin's Creed Black Flag. Modern day, but I after that, nothing. Feeling okay? Better. But I'm worried that it could happen again. The two data streams. I can't promise it won't. I barely understand it myself. It felt like two minds fighting over one brain. It hurt like a shotgun to the head. Right. There's something about this Viking's DNA sample that feels dense, noisy. Could it be the staff interfering somehow? How do you mean? My headaches, my temper. They started the day I got that thing. I hope you're not making excuses for, you know, your friend. Jesus, no. I'm not. Sorry. Just take it easy. And if you feel yourself slipping again, let us know. I'm trying. I really am. Sean, don't forget to water the plants while I'm under, okay? I'll add it to the calendar. I'll tattoo it on my leg. Hello, Layla. Sean, what do you make of the grave out there? Well, it overturns a few hundred years of scholarship about the first Europeans to set foot in North America. Apart from that, it's just a bunch of muddy bones, isn't it? Can we talk about this thing on my neck for a second? Ah, the mood stabilizer. Yes. It's not harmful, is it? I mean, I feel good, but I want to make sure there's no side effects. There shouldn't be. It's only blocking outside signals. A passive effect. So the staff doesn't, you know, mess with you. Sean, what happened last year, I, I had no control over that. I, I tried to resist. I understand. And your old team? Maybe they don't. But we've seen that sort of thing before. Still, if you want to work with us and get to the bottom of... Why the world is about to end for the second time in eight years. Then you wear that thing until we say otherwise. William's orders. I know. It's not a problem. 
It's just a few more weeks, yeah? Just until we figure this out. You're right. I know you're right. Beautiful, but it's not normal. I don't, I don't understand why they decided to go with all of this brown, right? I know you guys are seeing it too. Very brown. This is not how the world works. Like it's in a permanent fall setting. <laughs> All right. Well, ladies and gents, that is going to be it for today. We went over three hours. We completed East Anglia, so we're going to move on to one of the newer sections uh, coming up soon. Some quality stuff here. So hopefully you guys have been enjoying uh, the walkthrough. It's been my pleasure. We'll have another stream probably tomorrow as we want to get this... Uh, finished up because once cyberpunk comes out you know my main objective is going to be on that game and you know i want to put all my full love and attention to it so thank you all for tuning in i hope uh, you all enjoyed we got some more missions coming up very very soon for assassin's creed we're going to keep these streams going so love you guys take care of yourselves thanks again for watching be safe and i will see you on the next one peace